First, a troubling video has been circulating on social media. It shows an argument on a high school football field. The incident happened after the Landry Walker and Bell Chase game last night. Nikki Davidson has more. The finish to last night's Landry Walker Bell Chase football game kept fans on the edge of their seat. But when it was over, the energy turned into something else. Plaquemines Parish Sheriff's Office identified the man seen here in the video wearing a yellow jacket as a probation officer traveling with the Landry Walker side. In the video, he's tackled and detained by police. Deputies tell us he's not facing any charges tonight and that they're still trying to figure out exactly what happened. Eighth grader Abigail Overfield was there. She's a Bell Chase fan and recorded the video on her cell phone. It was ridiculous on the adults parts. I think they should they could have handled that a lot better. So was Karen Lewis, a school teacher rooting for Landry Walker. The learning experience for the for, that those children had, I don't think Bell Chase or Landry Walker would want that. Both fans have different accounts of what happened, but agreed it all started when the two teams did not shake each other's hands and that the students handled themselves better than the adults. Lewis hopes this game becomes a lesson talked about in classrooms. We need to do a little more discussion within our classrooms or something about good sportsmanship, about um, being able to accept the fact when your team loses or something. I think that could help. While Abigail hopes she doesn't experience anything like it again. And it wasn't about the winning or losing. It was about what happened after and the actions of the adults. A reminder that the young eyes watching last night won't soon forget what happened. In Plaquemines Parish, Nikki Davidson, Eyewitness News. Now, a spokesperson for Landry Walker School said tonight, quote, we were immediately notified about the altercation by our coaching staff following Friday's football game, and we are in the process of conducting our own internal investigation. Bell Chase High School also sent us a statement tonight that says, quote, since this is an ongoing investigation by the Plaquemine Parish Sheriff's Office, as well as the LHSAA, we are not able to make a statement until the investigation is complete.